Taking bookings with EasyBook is simple. Just type in two or three letters and the most likely address is suggested. The same applies to the destination. Names are optional for residential addresses but must be entered for commercial jobs, as in this case for a Tesco job. Once the end key is pressed, the booking is added to the list of outstanding jobs. The full details of any job can be seen by highlighting the job and pressing the enter key. In the centre of the screen we have a bar graph that shows just how busy you are and when you're overbooking. This takes into account the length of each job rather than simply how many jobs exist. Pre-bookings are also easy. For example, if a customer wants a booking for next Monday, tab twice to the calendar, select next Monday, then take the booking as normal. To select a specific car type, press F7, then select from the list. To add a comment, press F8 and just type. Preset comments can also be chosen to speed things up. Account jobs can be entered by account number or account name. If you need a specific car to do a job, simply press F10 and enter its number. F11 gives various options, all of which are just a single key press. Multiple jobs are automatically marked, i.e. car 1 of 3, 2 of 3, 3 of 3, etc. Allowance times on all the jobs can be overridden and entered manually. Finally, regular bookings can be set up for any number of days, weeks or even indefinitely. At the bottom of the screen we can see the areas where cars and jobs exist. Areas with outstanding jobs show in yellow while those with late jobs show in red. Down the side of the screen we have a similar list but here it shows the amount of time a car has been in its current state. Just to the left of this we have a mini map that shows at a glance where the cars and jobs are. Because EasyBook is a coordinate based software system the exact position of each car and job can be shown. This map can be expanded to show more exact detail including the car numbers. Another important feature is that EasyBook can link to most modern phone systems automatically inserting the phone numbers which then pops the customers details into the pickup boxes. The small microphone and speaker icon indicates that the call has been recorded and full voice playback of both the customer and the operator are available by a simple key press. Now let's look at the system being used. This is a company running just over a hundred private hire cars. It's Tuesday afternoon and fairly quiet with only 48 cars out working. There are two very camera shy telephonists and Tony the controller. The system is running on full auto dispatch which leaves Tony very little to do. During the making of this video not one single driver had to call in. For the remaining part of this video I'll leave you with the sights and sounds of full auto dispatch.